most of my time here, using the radio to coordinate everyone. Next up's the kitchen. Sam's our unofficial in-house chef, but... Well, there's only so much anybody can do with canned soup and pork rinds. Seriously, though. Rule number one, all the food stays in here and it stays sealed. You wouldn't believe how fast rats get into things otherwise. We learned that one the hard way. Sleeping quarters? Uh, hope you don't mind sharing. We're pretty tight on space here. Alan's been saying we should move to someplace bigger. But my dad's a carpenter, and he says we could build like a dorm room or something to get more space. How many people do you have here? I think you've met just about everybody, except maybe my brother and my dad. They're out scouting for supplies, I think. I haven't heard from them in a while. Rest easy, son. How do you feel? Like somebody took a weed whack in my fucking neck. We may have something here for the pain. Could be a sign of infection. We'll need to get Dr. Hansen out here. I'll see if I can get him on the radio. Thanks, I, uh, I appreciate the hospitality. Do not forget to entertain strangers, for by so doing, some have unwittingly entertained angels. How about that? I might be an angel. I'll pass. What's the word? God bless. Fuck you! Look, I, I didn't want to say this in front of your friend, but fever is a bad sign, especially after a bite. Pastor Will's going to try and get Doc Hansen to come down and take a look at him, but... If he doesn't get some antibiotics, he's probably not going to make it. If it comes to that, I promise Alan will take care of him. Bullet to the brain before he turns. It's for the best. Jesus, Lily, he's not a rabid dog. Don't you get it? More of us didn't make it than did. We can't be soft-hearted about this. Not anymore. We need medicine here anyway. You can't be sick. You understand? No one can be sick. So that's it, huh? Nice to meet you. Would you prefer to be shot in the face or kicked out on your asses? No, it's... Okay, look. We're barely hanging on here as it is. Medicine was some of the first stuff to run out. We don't have any to spare for your friend. I'm sorry. That's just the way it is. What if I find some more? Will that help pay our rent? <sighs> yeah. Okay, sure. If you can find a place to get more medicine, I'll make sure your friend has a place to stay. His name is Ed. I know. If you need to resupply before you head out, check the locker. Nobody minds if you're getting shit done and you need extra stuff. Just don't take shit you haven't earned. Airy secure. I don't think I can do that. I'm confused. There's a cell tower behind the swine and bovine. From up there, you should be able to get a good look at the town. Maybe you'll spot some place to find medicine. Thank you. Just hurry, okay? I'm not sure how long I can rein Alan in. Not gonna happen. Nope. Nope. Eat this! Anybody to know there's shit around here these days. What else? <laughs> Over here!
did you all end up at the church anyway? Geez, I don't know. At first it just seemed like the place to go, you know? End of the world and all that. Then we started hearing about how bad it was getting. Other people tried to go it alone and ended up... Well, we just sort of stayed here after that. Just the six of you? No. There used to be 12 of us. Something's still moving around in here. this place locked down. Well, shit. I think I can get a decent view from up there. Damn, I'm tired. <clears throat> Damn, I'm tired. <sighs> I'm there. Gonna take a look around. There's a building we'll want to check out. Gotcha.
Hey, I think that place is inhabited. Yeah, I was afraid of that. We got a horde on our hands. I see some place worth a scavenging run. Gotcha. Yeah, I was afraid of that. We got a horde on our hands. There we go. Hey, what's that? Looks like a vet's office or something. Oh yeah, Dr. Gilroy's clinic. What about it? Well, antibiotics for dogs aren't any different than antibiotics for people, and it looks like no one's broken in. <laughs> That's a good idea. Okay, sounds like it's worth checking out. Somebody's broadcasting something. You folks got any room at the inn? You might want to go check it out. No. Nope. Over here! Come and get it! I'm sending Alan and Sam to meet you at the clinic. Alan? Gee, thanks. It was that, or let him stay here and keep grumbling about kicking you and Ed out. Point. I don't think I can do that. We're lucky we aren't dead already, and we owe a lot of that to you. Any chance you'd have some space for us? How about it? Give me a minute. Come with me. I'm on it. Let's do this quietly. Bag's almost full. This is good, right? I mean, it doesn't suck. Let's roll. Keep an eye on our six. Let's dance! <laughs> Get up! 
Might wanna swing wide. We got zombies to the left. <coughs> I need a breather. like no zombies were close by. Crap. That's gonna bring trouble. Sir. Fuck you! Sounds good. Maybe if we weren't down to an expired bottle of baby aspirin and a case of cough syrup, we wouldn't have so many sick people. Ooh, brainwave. Check this out. We need some more sleeping space. People are already sharing beds and shifts. Now, I've drawn up some basic plans, but we'll want to get on this in a hurry. People are already talking about leaving. Nah. Well, shit. What did I say? No cars. About time you showed up. Let's get this show on the road. You're the newbie, so you get a bust in the window. The door will make less noise. 
Or, hey, you could do it like a total fucking idiot. Up to you. Just get us inside. Hey, let me give you something. Fuck you! Well, shit. <laughs>